The first tonight, we start in Clay County. A ceremony was held in West Point tonight for a pregnant woman and her one-year-old daughter who died in a fire earlier this week. Our Evan Hensley was at tonight's event. He joins us now with an update. And thank you, Emily. This ceremony was here, held here at Zuber Park, where friends and family members came together to celebrate the life of Shayla Swain and her daughter, Serenity Cox. The two died in a fire on Wednesday. Fire officials say the fire was caused due to an electrical issue with an extension cord. The family also says that Shayla was five months pregnant with a boy. She tried to do everything she could for her kids and if it was somebody out there that was needing some, Shayla was there to help them. I've heard a lot of people talk about losing a child, but when you lose one on your own, you find out the feeling that people are going through. It's a hard feeling. And when I spent time talking to the family, they told me they've been overwhelmed with the amount of support and the turnout for this ceremony that happened tonight. For now, reporting live in West Point, Evan Hensley, WTVA 9 News.